today on my Twitter feed, I saw a reply to a tweet from Brittany Cooper, who was a Warren supporter. And this person that replied to her tweet in terms of having a black woman besides Val Demons and Kamala Harris, who will be a quote unquote detriment to um, a presidential ticket with Biden, said um, Ayanna Presley will be a great choice or Stacey Abrams. So my take on this is, as I always say, so my take on this, nope. I like Ayanna Presley and I like Stacey Abrams, but that's a no for me. With Ayanna Presley, Ayanna Presley is still a first year, um, a first term um, representative. And before that, she only served in local positions um, to, and also an aide to Joe Kennedy. And she was also an aide to, uh, I believe, of John Kerry back in the day so i mean nah i don't see any foreign policy knowledge i mean she serves on one of the top committees in the house which is the oversight committee and then other committees but i don't see the foreign policy and i just don't see her being joe's running mate and honestly to tell you i don't think she wants it i don't blame her because she was not even a consideration according to the advisory team that is vetting candidates for joe biden so that's one. Stacey Abrams is really not like a top, top consideration. She's someone floating in the air, but no. She has, she didn't even serve in a federal position. She only served on a state level position. To me, I think the VP candidate should have experience within either the house for years or the senate because the senate is more powerful than the house because the senate actually puts judges on there and they deal with more foreign policy than even some uh, parts of the house the house passed laws but the senate deals with a lot of classified information it's that's why they're like it's a six-year term because they put judges on there and they do all kinds of stuff so the person i believe as a black woman that's qualified is Kamala Harris. And Kamala Harris has um, experience. She's very smart. Um, she's also equipped. And I believe that she will bring um, balance to Joe Biden's ticket in terms of turning out mostly black women. They say progressives um, are the biggest turnout, but it's not many who are, you know, Black, I mean, there are black prog progressives, and even they'd be okay with a Kamala ticket, but um, putting Presley and Abrams on a ticket is a no go. And even Val Demons is like, nah. But the person I see that has the experience, has the qualifications, and can actually work with Joe Biden is Kamala Harris, and that is my analysis on it.